Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Hora Truck and we are playing City Skylines After Dark together in our city, Cyclist's Heaven. In the last episode we did a uh, revamp of our city, we uh, basically put in little nooks and crannies of these um, low density commercial zones and high density commercial zones. We inserted them into our uh, um, residential areas. So that people can do their daily grocery shopping and um, all that stuff by foot, ideally. If they have time and... Um, yeah, they can do it without without a car. That's what uh, matters the most. Now I'm thinking... What can we do to make the city more bike friendly? I'm going to let the, let the game run. That's fine. Just to rake in some more cash, we will have to do a public transport uh, thing. That's always pretty expensive. I think I'll go ahead and make some of these small connections like this. So cyclists are able to cross these huge city blocks without having to without having to move around too much basically like that so they can yeah cyclists are our preferred it's our preferred way of getting around so we will do everything in our in our hands to make them get around faster we want a new prison hashtag prison all right grow the city and yeah, they want more they want more industry I don't think we will do that now. Might do it soon though. Yeah, this is an excellent spot for a biking path to give um, bicycle riders the possibility of. Yeah, and they are they are already using it to change between these streets and so on. Um, do more of that. I think we have a bicycle bridge over here, so it might be possible to. Go over there with only yeah bulldozing one building. That's fine then. And here we can go through perhaps. Is this to no we have to bulldoze those two buildings. Shall we do that? Yeah, I think it's probably worthwhile. They'll rearrange, build other houses over there. Okay, maybe we can do one here. that and um, yeah this is already pretty good for cyclists I don't don't have to do anything more over here could um, put in one bicycle path over here all right something like that And this is the highway, so cyclists are not really concerned with the highway. Um, yeah, we've got some some throughput over here. Could do one over here. And um, yeah, why not? Why not really? Yeah, all right, we pull those those two buildings. Going to bulldoze those two. And do this. Oh, this took this took a lot of zoning space out there. I think it's fine though. Just make the city as biking friendly as it can be. I have to do that on the other side of the on the other bank of the river too. This guy here. What we could do is do something like that. Have a, a thing going on down here that basically joins up. Would that be preferable? I don't I don't think so. 
It's not really needed. This is a, a playground. Fine. Can we, can we go through here? No. The playground's taking take too much space. We could go through here, I guess. This is a crematorium. Alright, fine. Do it that way. So we have something that puts us through there. Then we can use this natural opening to get through. We have one here. Black one on this side, but I don't think it's really necessary. We have a Japanese garden over here. That's all fine and dandy. Here's one. Here's one. Here's another road. They can use the roads too, because we have bicycle lanes. Take this one, where I don't have to build us any buildings. Take that any day. And this also looks like a prime object for going through. There's nothing so conveniently placed over here, so I'll have to just have to build out some buildings. But here's one where we can... We can go through. No. Like that. Can't we... Can't we... Yeah, we can join this up. That's very good. Join this up. Join this up. So, some sort of a parallel neighborhood. Cycling railway. Would it be possible to join us up here? Might be overkill, but let's do it. This, at least um, this is cyclist heaven, not not neighborhood heaven. Although there's no reason to do this extensive emphasis on cycling without thinking about the quality of life because that's why you want to do it in the first place the concentration on, of, on cycling and cyclists because you have, you have less pollution if you're using cyclists and you get a lot of health benefits if you're riding a bike it makes you a lot fitter and um, yeah, just using time that you would have to use anyway because you have to go to work Can get can go over here, I think. Should be able to. Let's move over here. Can I go in here without yeah I can. Move over here. Do something like that. Also come up here. Fine. I don't think I can link it to this guy. Can I? We do it anyway. And come through here. Very fine. And then we're going to link it up on this side. I think I should keep in mind to have a cyclist's road between future zones. Just have to plan that in. Can we go through here? I oh, can't really. Alright then, we can do something like that perhaps. Without, without bulldozing the building, I'm sure there's a way. I saw one. Can I not do that? I would really like to. Hmm. It's a bit tricky. Yeah, I guess I won't. I guess I, it won't fit. All right, do it that way then. This annoys me. It didn't work properly. So you have to go. Build me a proper cyclist's lane. I mean, it should be possible. Go on. Alright. Curtail this thing. 
Right, we have this. Can we fit one in here? Yes, we can. Very good. And I think we could fit one in here going through. Very good. Can we fit one in here, though? That's a pretty tough question. I don't think we can. Do it anyway. I, I um, guess it would have been easier if I had planned for that in advance. Now this is too tight. And this is also too tight to do something like that. But we have now lots of um, crossings. I think I future-proofed this. By just... Doing that beforehand. So we have a biking lane that runs runs behind these houses. Right. Would be nice if I could do it without bulldozing everything. And yeah, come down here. That looks great. Just lovely. Would it be possible to fit one in here without bulldozing? Yes. No, no. Sorry! Um, here's some more space that we could go through. Take advantage of this, of this thing. Very good. Here's also some space that we might go, go through. Yeah, well, there's that one house, it's fine. There really isn't any space. Um, here's one though, although I say that, we will lose this house, but it would be a lot nicer if we can go through and go through here, yeah, without losing anything. It's always preferable. I mean, if you would do this in a real city, you would get riots bulldozing through people's backyards and everything but since it's a game it allows us to follow our pet peeves so go through here so something like that perfect have a cyclist's lane to go around the school And then, yeah, I guess I should extend this road. So give me the roads. Give me our standard two-lane road with bicycle lanes. And then it must already be... No, it isn't. It should be connected up here. Like that, then. Okay, fine. Very good. Yeah, that's, that's looking perfect. That's looking really lovely. We've got a thorough cyclists network down here. Take one more bicycle lane down here to meet up. I wonder if I should do bridges over the roads, but it strikes me as a bit excessive. Can I not, can I not connect these guys up? Yeah, like that. No, no, it is a ridge, so we might be able to go under there. Is this too steep for cyclists? I don't think so. Yeah, perfect. Perfect. Looks like it was made to be. Um, yeah, that is a proper, proper cyclist's neighborhood. And I think I have to do the same on the other side. Although here it is a bit easier, because I have lots of space behind these buildings. 
So we can actually have a point with an access point through here, I think. Oh, we have one here. So we use that. Hopefully we won't have to bulldoze any buildings. Come over here. Oh no. That wasn't good, but yeah, whatever. Try to live with it. Yeah. Have the playground be properly connected. It's a bit sad for me that you cannot. What is this shenanigans? Let me come off here. Yeah. Alright, do it again. Just don't interfere with the playground. Why is that even a problem? Am I doing something wrong? Listen, buddy. You've annoyed me long enough. I cannot relocate this building because it must be placed roadside. Oh well, then we'll place you over here. All the people are pissed that I place it somewhere where they don't want it to be. I think it would fit better over here. After all, yeah, another house is built, and we will have another access point for our bicycle lanes. We have something like that, and it looks a bit odd. But I guess it's fine. That's a bit meandering. And I'm pretty glad I left all this space empty. I would have some problems. I'm going to go through here. Very nice. That's kind of a busy road. I wonder if I shouldn't do some sort of bicycle bridge. Yeah, let's do that. Come off here. Then, yeah, fair we will cut through this. On the other hand, it might be easy to go under it. Like this, and then come up here. Yeah, like that. So we avoid all the problems. Plus, it's a bit nicer if you're a cyclist. You really don't want to go up bridges, because it costs a lot of energy. And not really getting anything out of it, because yeah, you go up the bridge and then on the other side you go down the bridge. You've gained nothing across the road, but at what, at what expense. Um, I will have to, to extend this road in the future. Space already occupied by what? Oh no, I cannot go by by the streets. I forgot, sorry. So that is a proper bicycle lane going all the way through. Try to connect them. What is that? They all got destroyed because I did this? Weird. But in the end, um, our citizens were We'll be glad that we did it like this. So I'm going to give this the proper access. And people are already using it. I'm glad of it. Come over here. We'll do that. That's all fine and dandy. Can we can we go through this? I want to bulldoze both buildings. Looks like I have to. Okay, fine then. Garbage collection doesn't work anymore, that's no good. Lots of garbage collection. Oh, although, it's fine, it's fine. Let's, let's look at the garbage. 
Oh yeah, we have a lot of garbage production, and it's going over our incinerator capacity. We have lots of money, so it doesn't really matter. Build another incinerator. That's fine. Well, let's build another one. Yeah, garbage city is another thing that we will have to do. What we have to, to connect, I guess. Oh yeah, this industry uh, district is now filled. It's filled to the max, I think. That makes me happy. Um, there's some demand for residential. I guess it's it's fair to say that I bulldozed a bit of it. I'm going to to do that later. Rebuilding some of it, and we are bringing in a lot of money that way. Oh, my income is down. Yeah, doesn't concern me. Not a problem, as long as it's green and money is coming in, it's fine. Now let us look at this junction. Um, parks, bicycle lanes. Oh yeah, sorry, I noticed that we are over time. Um, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please give me a like. If you didn't, please tell me why, so I can improve. And if you want to see more of this series or my other content in the future, please consider subscribing. It helps me out a great deal. I hope you join me next time when we will be finishing our um, pathing for the cyclists on this bank of the river. We will be connecting anti-scam fields with our bicycle paths and make it possible for cyclists to reach Garbage City. And then we will probably do some public transportation putting down some rails, maybe installing the uh, cargo, cargo hub over here, plopping down a university so we can get more educated people, all that, all that good stuff. Well, that has to wait until the next episode. See you then. Thanks and bye-bye.